Alexis, your film Many Worlds, why did you use an improv-based script as your guide? Well, okay, I have done some writing in the past. I'm, I, I call myself an ex-poet because I actually went through a period of trying to develop a career as a, as a poet, um, which is very impractical. You have to teach poetry as well. It's a very difficult thing to do. Um, I, uh, so I've done some writing. I've, I wrote a load of short stories once, which I, I did send one of them off. Um, so I had some I had some writing experience. Um, I wrote a novel, a novella once. Absolutely nuts, did that novella. But when I came to to many worlds, what's interesting about many worlds, or what I found interesting about many worlds, is that four members of the audience were going to have their bio signals read. So a little bit, a little bit like I'm wired up with a microphone. They were going to be wired up. One of them with their, measuring their perspiration one of them measuring their brain waves, one of them their heart rate, and one of them their muscle tension, you know, where they're gripping the seat or whatever. Um, and then this would be analyzed by computer and a different edit of the film would be selected live in the cinema based on uh, what's called their arousal level, basically, depending on how um, physically intense they were coming over as being. So, Thing with that, you can't just have one script because I say it's a different edit. It was actually a different story. So there were four different stories. They all started the same. Then they split into two. Then each of those two split into two. Now it was just a short, but um, still writing four different stories for my first script. Um, it not only seemed like a uh, very hard work to write these four because writing four short scripts and writing one script that has four ways through it is very different. Because when you write four short scripts, they can all be different. They can be different styles, different stories, whatever. But when you write four scripts where it's actually one script, they have to have a coherence of storyline and a film ability and all of these things which are I, 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 very difficult to do. Would have been, for me as a first time script writer, would have been very, very difficult to do. Now, I'd seen um, Goodbye Promise and um, I, I thought, well, this this is good, you know. This is <laughs> this doesn't seem. It's not like you're watching it thinking, oh yeah, this is improvised. Oh yeah, this is improvised, you know. And I I thought, I wonder what would happen if I, because I kind of what would happen if I wrote the story? Because I think what I did first with many words, I wrote the story that with four roots through it. And when I say write the story, I'd literally just as it came to my head, you know, she does this, he does that, he says this, she says that, and you're not going to write. The whole script that way. There's, there's, and um, and I thought, well, what if I? That's what I gave to the actors, and I th and then worked with them to rehearse and to come up. You know, this is, so it's got suggested dialogue, and then um, they could try that, and then I could say, look, I need these concepts put into it. And interestingly, the two actors that were speaking the most had a lot of experience of improv and working together doing improv, which was so fortunate uh, that that was the case. Um, I'm probably more fortunate than I realised at the time. So I, so I worked with them to do that and afterwards I thought well actually this is quite interesting because the human mind, you know, it, we naturally think in multiple strands. We think in many worlds. We think, um, uh, you know, what am I going to do today? Uh, I might do this, I might do that. We, 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 and when we're fearful, we think of all the different scenarios. We write multiple scripts, you know, they're not scripts, but multiple stories in our heads of what's going to happen. Um, and so the human mind very naturally thinks in terms of multi-branching scripts, but it doesn't write in those terms. It, 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 so having a, having a script where people had to think it to bring it to life, they had to act it, to bring it to life was more natural than trying to write a four-way script because what I was saying to the actors in fact the actors knew the script better than I did in the sense that by the end of the film I was saying to them so what did you know I was meant to be directing this I was like so what did what's this one and then this route through the script what do you do and then that route they knew it better than me because the human mind is naturally good at thinking in terms of multi paths but it's a lot different when you're the writer you're trying to do that and I'm so glad that I kind of had the inspiration it was it was it was a good by promise but it was also a film that you folks reported on set on a subway train that used some improv as well so it's both from the film courage website that I heard 
about these things and that kind of inspired me to try this. So that's the background. <laughs>